Good evening, everyone. A social media firestorm. Folks from all across the country standing up for a tri-state Marine. And the controversy surrounded this flag you see here, Marine Corps flag. The Homeowners Association asked him to take it down. But Jordan Burgess has the fallout from controversy and the response from the Homeowners Association. That flag is still flying here tonight. A few hours ago, the Triple Crown Homeowners Association agreed to allow any United States issued flag. And the move followed a barrage of angry calls and emails that some think unfairly singled out one worker. You can't miss the Marine Corps flag outside Scott Wallace's home, but this week it drew some other attention. Wallace posted on his Facebook page this notice that the flag violated the Triple Crown Homeowners Association rules. It says Marine flag not permitted, U.S. flag only. That surprised Dale Kamick, who lives down the street, and says he's flown a Marine Corps flag for years. You know, they have to have certain rules, but uh, to come against the Marine Corps flag since 1775, you know, it ain't going to happen. So why the violation? We called Town Properties, which issued it. They say they don't make the rules. The homeowners do. They just enforce them. A new manager had just done a recent sweep looking for violations of all kinds. Her brother's an Iraq vet, so obviously she wasn't deciding she didn't like this guy's Marine Corps flag. She was she was doing what she thought the board needed her to do. After the Facebook post, Town Properties went to the Homeowners Association. And say, hey, guys might want to change your bylaws and let a man fly his Marine Corps flag. And the association agreed. Wallace can fly his flag. But those with town property say the manager who issued the warning as the association's rules instructed her to do is now getting death threats. People out there on the internet with you know the protection of anonymity have made some pretty nasty threats against her and her family and that's pretty scary. Wallace didn't want to talk to us on camera, but he posted on Facebook that he wanted to thank the manager for following up and that he knows she didn't mean anything disrespectful. He urged his supporters to quote, take that passion that is burning inside for America and help out our veterans. Jordan Burgess, nine on your side.